ensuring that food is cooked to appropriate temperatures is crucial for inactivating parasites and their eggs and preventing their illness connected to parasitic infections. While specific data on specific parasites and temperatures and time needed for inactivation is lacking, general guidelines uh, to inactivate them can be followed to enhance food safety. There is a number of articles talking about proper cooking and freezing times. Uh, I will try to make a summary for you. First, I want you to know that killing larvae and adult worms is not the same as uh, killing eggs. Why? Because eggs are protected with thick and strong layer of uh, hitin or other proteins that help them to survive extreme conditions. For example, survive uh, winter in soil or water or survive our uh, stomach acid. In some regions where water can be contaminated, uh, you should boil it uh, for at least 3 to 10 minutes. Not just to make it boil and off the kettle, but boiling, constant boiling for 3 to 10 minutes. It will kill uh, most of parasites. Most likely it will kill all of them. If uh, the, the water is extremely contaminated, you may need to boil it for one or two, two hours. We all heard about Giardia lamblia. Uh, the study investigated the inactivation of uh, Giardia cysts uh, using vinegar and they found that at room temperature, 21 degrees Celsius, no cysts remained viable after being treated with uh, undiluted vinegar for one hour. If less or if diluted, some were surviving. There is some high-risk um, seafood, for example, freshwater fish or crustaceans. Uh, you need to boil them for at least 10 minutes to get rid of parasites. If you are making soup, for example, uh, make it boil and then on slow fire for 20 to 30 minutes is usually enough. If we are talking about microwaving, uh, they don't uh, reliably kill parasites because of uneven heating. It doesn't ensure that food will reach the recommended internal temperature. That's why microwave is no-no. Okay, freshwater fish. What about freezing? We like sushi or smoked fish. Raw fish for sushi must be frozen before making sushi. Uh, our usual um, fridge has minus 18 or minus 20 Celsius or minus 4 Fahrenheit. Uh, you must keep it uh, there for uh, at least 7 days. Or um, flash frozen at deep freezing. Uh, it's like minus 35 degrees Celsius for at least 15 hours. It doesn't kill all the parasites. A uh, usual freezer doesn't affect um, parasite eggs uh, almost at all but uh, some of larvae and adult worms will be dead so it's better than nothing especially for sushi lovers vegetables of course there are pores where it can be some soil with parasite eggs you can use the brush to remove uh, the eggs mechanically it will remove 80 to 90 percent of eggs and then uh, put it uh, soak it in, into vinegar or salt water or blanch it for one to two minutes but uh, better to peel it off to remove all these pores with remaining soil. What about pressure cooker? This is cooking under high pressure where you can reach uh, the higher temperature up to 120 degrees Celsius. And 10 minutes is uh, usually enough to kill everything there. So it's a very highly effective method. Drying, salting or smoking these methods may reduce parasitic viability but are not reliable uh, not as reliable as uh, cooking. Salt and vinegar. Uh, salt you must use 20% uh, salt solution or vinegar, 9% vinegar for at least several hours to um, damage the egg shell but uh, it won't uh, kill all of them. Anyway, better than nothing and again better after freezing. If we're talking about smoking, uh, only hot smoking helps to kill uh, parasites. So, what are their conclusions? Boiling or pressure cooking are the best. 10 minutes is enough. Boil water for 3 to 10 minutes if it uh, has uh, the con contamination risks. 
frying and baking at a temperature above 75 degrees for 20 to 30 minutes. It depends on the thickness of the piece, so it will be um, reaching the temperature needed inside the piece. Steamer, uh, steaming for 10 to 15 minutes, less effective than direct boiling, but still effective. Vegetables and fruits, better to peel, if not, uh, use, use the brush and then blanch or vinegar or saline solution. Freezing, again, better than nothing. Uh, better deep freezing, uh, usual freezing, better uh, at least one week or months. And smoking, only hot smoking, damages parasites. Dear friends, thank you for watching this video. Thanks to everyone who support this channel. I wish you good luck. Have a good day. Goodbye. Don't be afraid.